fat on the high end. Well, not really fat. A little bit fat on the high end, which is fine. Especially since your transition is awesome. <laughs> Take it off.
I'm going to do is I'm going to get a nice little uh, pattern up there in the sky. I'm going to change it to a left-hand turn pattern. And then uh, what I'm going to do is um, eventually, when I'm up high enough, I'm going to say, are you ready? You say, yeah. I'm going to, all right, all right, plant yours in three, two, one, plant yours, and then you're flying. So, and all you got to do... Is we're going to trip out your radio first. Um, you're just going to fly it straight. I'm going to, you're going to be flying it. We're going to see what it does. We're going to go hands off. We're going to see if it tilts, banks, does anything funny. And we'll, we'll correct it. Either you or me by mucking with your radio a little bit. And then we're just going to do these nice little left hand turn patterns. The key with the pattern is uh, you go, then you do your maneuver. You turn, you bank. And then you finish the move, maneuver before you go into the next one. Make sure the plane's you know, flat, steady, forward, you know, all, all is good. Before then you can bank again. Sound good? Sounds like a plan. All right. So I need to change my throttle all the way up. Yeah, peg it. Peg it. Are you ready? I am ready. All right, let me turn it back, and then I'm going to give you control. All right. Three, two, one. Plane is yours. You're flying like an old pro already. You can tell you've got lots of stuff. Start dropping it. And like where you are now, I would turn into a glider. You're, you're fine. You, did, you can get you got plenty of opportunity to get low. I don't care if you fly over the field. He is getting used to feeling how the airplane feels when you don't have a lot of airspeed. The ailerons aren't affected. The airplane's a little bit sluggish. Speed. Yep. And that is an easy way to stall a stall yep. plane. I actually like to stall it up at altitude. That's, that's, that's great practice. Pull the engine and uh, just try to try to maintain level flight. Eventually, you won't be able to. And uh, if it was a warbird, you should drop a wing and go into a spin. The trainer is probably just going to push forward. You add a little power to Uh, well, today, frankly, this little bit of wind doesn't matter. It's always nice to do any fancy maneuver into the wind. Because you have lower ground speed, but higher effective wind speed. Everything about an airplane is keeping you know, wind over the wings. I can't believe how this thing is just gliding. Yeah. Trainers are nice and soft on the they got a lot of wing area for the weight. 